What's good, YouTube? This your boy, Tony, the finesse guy, man. And I'm back with another video of 60 Days In, man. And um, we got this new guy, this new inmate. He's not a participant. His name is James. Now, we all got James in our life, you know, somebody like James in our life that, that nobody can't trust. That's always telling these crazy-ass stories. That's always lying. But might have some truth to it, but you know, it, it just sounds like something out of a movie. Just something don't sound right about it. But we all have a, a James in our life that we just can't trust because, you know, he, he's always lying. But, uh, but because they're always lying. But um, before we get into this video, man, like I always say, if you don't have cable TV, you can always watch me, your boy Tony the Finesse Guy, man. And make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that bell button so you get notified on all my new videos, man. All right, let's get into it. James, he's a redhead guy. He's a liar, country boy. He came in uh, a day or so after I'd been in, started talking to me initially. Uh, just I'd hang on the rail, he just started talking. Talk, talk, talk. Here's what I'm in for, here's where I'm from, here's my family, here's this and that. Why does this guy tell me all this? I don't trust James a bit. Initially, James tell, told me he's in for uh, two counts of attempted murder. So I'm thinking, man, this, this kid don't look like, he, he don't fit the bill, he don't fit the part. But go ahead, I'll, I'll, I'm listening, what do you got? I'm getting what he's saying now. He's uh, he... Man, his ass ain't in there for no attempted murder. I'm thinking it's just something, you know, just to try to scare everybody. Like, oh, I'm in here for attempted murder. The motherfucker's lying, but I'm pretty sure that they can get in the system and pull up his charges. Let's see if they figure this dude out, because something tells me this nigga ain't in there for no damn attempt to murder. He looked like a damn crackhead, you know? He sat him down in his shirt. He looked like a crackhead, you know? He don't look like somebody that's in there for attempt to murder. I'm not saying crackheads don't murder people, because they do, you know what I mean? From what I've seen on First 48. But um, I don't know, man. But he, I don't think, I think he lying. Let's see, man. Nervous, he was scared. I think he wanted to come into the jail and immediately be a badass. Um, it, it didn't work out for him. He just, he, he constantly lies, 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 lies. Talking about uh, Red Ox and Harley Davidson and all that. The reason I want a Harley because they drive shit. I've been sitting there thinking about it. Whenever I get out of prison, I'm heading that west. He just fabricate everything. He's he said he's a. F How do you now see that suspect is fucked that? Right? Like you know what I mean? If I was in there, I would have thought he was something like a participant or something from sixty days in. How you don't know your age? Uh, twenty twenty three. You know what I'm saying? This guy got to be tweaking on something, man. Fighter, we look him up on YouTube. So he said you're the first boxer. I was sitting there just talking about that. Oh, you want him to look up the videos? Can you look? Can you pull it up and see if he was cheating or not? Or does? Tell him the name. Huh? James. 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 Hey, 
Homeboy said, can I see a fight that you actually won? You know, I don't think it's good to go in jail tearing everybody that you done got knocked out. But if you think about it, he's a professional fighter. You know what I mean? He can probably, you know, take on half of the guys in there. You know what I'm saying? But maybe he was a professional fighter when he was younger. He don't look like he's in shape. But that don't mean anything, you know. You don't ever want to underestimate, underestimate anybody. But if if it's a professional fighter, man, you know, he can, he can probably take about half of them dudes up in there. You know what I mean? But some of them are a little bigger than him out of his weight size and, you know, out of his weight range. And some of the other guys in there are probably fighters too. But telling people that you done got knocked out, man, don't do that, man. Because once you get that commissary, they're going to knock you out and take your commissary, man. He is a fighter, but I think it's safer to call him a punching bag. Well, that's it, man. Uh, James the liar, the favorite man. Can't nobody trust him. Um, I can't wait to see him. You know what I mean? I haven't seen him on the last few episodes. So let's see if we uh, get introduced to James tomorrow, man. You know what I mean? I don't know how many more episodes they're gonna have a 60 days in you know um hopefully they extend it a little bit longer with this COVID-19 on and all of us watching everything on TV but um before I end this video like I say man if you ain't got nothing to watch if you, ain't, if you don't have cable TV you can always watch me your boy Tony Finesse guy man before we head out make sure you like comment and subscribe when you subscribe, make sure you hit that bell button when you comment. Just know that I'm going to reply. All that bougie. Just be respectful, man. That's all I ask for. All right, y'all. I'm out.